Hello? Yeah, yeah, it's me. Oh, oh, well, I see. Um, yeah. Yeah, I understand. Okay. Oh, great, thanks. Bye. Morph? What? It's a done deal. They took my pizza for you. Well, shoot. You suck. That's not it, Marv. There's more. We've lost everything. Everything. What? How in the blazes did that happen, Jerry? You pig headed lord bucket of armpits! I'm sorry, but at least we have each other. You're as ugly as homemade sin. I, I can't hang around here no more. I'm getting out. I'm leaving town. Marv, no! No, Marv! Marv! Marv, you can't do this to me! Marv! Two years, Marv! Two years! But Marv! Marv! No! How could you leave me now? After all we've been through. Now, Jerry, you don't understand. I... Who's that? That was a. Uh, that was Mr. Varva. He's a. Uh, he was hung in an old Miles Towers tomb. I think you know who I mean. Yeah. There was a. Uh, there was Rickman Fairweather. He's a. Uh, he's a top lady enthusiast in all Oklahoma. Jerry. Jerry, I'm in love with him. I'm in love with Rickman Fairweather. Well, well, that comes as quite the shock, Marv. I know, but Rickman Fairweather and I have been together for three years, Jerry. I... Three years, Marv! We've only been married for two! I know, but Rickman Fairweather was poor then, and I love the free pizza I got from being with you, Jerry. It's, uh, it's really your best quality. But think about it, Marv. The man has a soup ladle for a hand. That's not normal. And you have a lifelong dream of becoming a cowboy, Jerry. Is that any more normal? Yeah, actually, Marv, it is. I gotta go. Call me if you get your pizza or your back. What do you think about that? I think you've got saliva on your chin. I think... I think this town ain't big enough for the two of us. Pigtails. Well, I really got the west. Jerry. Who are you? Who wants to know? Me. Jerry. Jerry Wayne. Mm. Why? Your book's the only book! That greatest cowboy that ever did live! So I am. <laughs> Why? You eat, breathe, and sleep. The Wild West. You know, I, I heard you got horse blood running through your veins. Is that true? 
What are you doing out here in the middle of nowhere with your sewing machine? Well, being the greatest cowboy that ever did live ain't all there is to it. Man's got to follow his patience. Well, do you think you could uh, teach me how to be a real cowboy? Nah, I gotta finish this by tomorrow. It's for my wife. It's okay. <sighs> Please, Bedoni Buck. I need a mentor real bad or I'll never get to be a real cowboy. Why do I want to be a cowboy so bad? Well, you see, my parents were cowboys and they're dead now, but you know, I just want to follow in their footsteps. It's my passion. Yeah. I'll teach y'all right here, but you gotta take pain over beauty. You gotta be tough to make it out in this life. No mercy. I, I, I can do all of that. <laughs> Wipe off those rosy cheeks, kid. We're gonna ride. Jackson Ripley, we need some of your galloping land whales. Well, oh my, oh my, Tony Buck, what are you doing right here? Last I heard, you was starting your own sewing company. Well, I'm teaching this kid here the ways of the West. Now I need a horse. Of course, of course, but don't need. Wait, what, what was that you needed again? What, what in donation? A horse, Jackson, a horse. Wait, what? Now this time I need you to concentrate, Jackson. I need you to give me a horse. Hey, but no. horse. Got you. A boy, set up one of them horses. Make it. I like your mustache. Thanks. I'm a phone exchange student. <laughs> All right. Get out of here, boy. Stop creeping around. Jay, why don't you go with the hangman and see they just get your horse? Alright. Hey, why are you wasting your time on this kid? What's his deal? Because his name is Jerry Wayne. He's a Wayne. His last name is Wayne. Does he know? No. I must never know. Think about that, Bodoni. You're a real cowboy. I'm a what? A, a cowboy. True grits? True grits. Here, I made you this. It's a true emblem of a cowboy. I'll go try it on now. Where'd you get that, kid? Where'd you get it, Badoni? I said, where'd you get it, Badoni? All right, fine. I killed your parents. Wait, what? That's not... I murdered them. That's your mother's necklace. I killed them. Well, that comes to squat the shark, Badoni. Don't talk to me like I'm some common housewife. I killed your parents. Honestly, you suck. Why'd you do that? Who can tell? Sometimes I manage to go kill somebody. Well, I don't want no part of that. Uh. Foreign exchange student? Why'd you do that? Cause I'm really your son! No! My son. My child. I'm out.